Hello guys, we are back with our next tutorial. In this tutorial, let us go through bitmap indexing, guys. So this is a special feature which we observe in Oracle, guys. When we are using Oracle database, we'll be observing this. So basically, whenever the, it is true or false, we'll be inserting yes or no, right? So those things are two two things, which we will be inserting. Those will be under this bitmap indexing, guys. Fine. Okay. So like, let us assume male or female. So let us assume male as one and female as two. In this way, only two two option things will be stored in this bitmap, guys. Okay. So in bitmap index, Oracle creates bitmaps for each unique value of a single column. So for each row, sorry, for each column, it is going to create it, guys. So each bitmap contains a single value, either zero or one, for each record in the database. One indicates that the row has a value, and zero does not in indicates that it does not have a value. So here you'll be understanding the concept guys. Don't worry. You'll be clearly understanding it. Okay. So Oracle scans these bitmaps to find the row matching guys. So whenever you are comparing with rows and rows, let us assume you select, you wrote a query, select a star from this employee belongings to this. So in indirectly, it will be having, let us assume we are having three departments. So it will be having department one, department two, department three. So if the first guy, is in department one, it will be considering here one. So in the in the department two, he will not be there, right? So it will be zero, zero. So in this way, it will be analyzing. So we will be going through this example, you'll be understanding, don't worry. So here we are having role number, name, gender, passport. So here gender, we are having two options, right? Male and female. So male, female. If you, if you are male, here Ram is male. So that's the reason why it gave one. He's not female. So that's the reason why it gave zero. Fine? So that is the reason We'll be using this bit, bitmaps, guys. Whenever, whenever you write a query, it will be really efficient to get it from in this way. So wherever it is male, we'll be inserting ones. And if this guy is female, sorry, she is female, we'll be writing here. So similarly, passport. If they are having passport, yes, either no. So I hope everyone got a small idea. And remember, in a single row, never will be having two ones or two or more ones for a particular column. Fine. I hope everyone got a small idea on this. So in the next tutorial, we'll be going through transactions, guys. So let us meet in the next tutorial. Thank you. Thanks for watching.